Hey guys, this is Amit and you are watching Tech Dad. In this video, we are going to compare between Redmi 9 Power versus M21 and we will discuss which one is better in camera, performance, display, audio of the devices, features, communication chips and about the prices. And in the end of the video, I will tell you which one is better according to me. So watch this video till the end. So without wasting any time, let's start the video. Let the comparison start with the camera, starting with the rear camera of the devices. 9 Power have quad camera setup, 48 megapixel of wide camera, 8 megapixel of ultra wide camera, 2 megapixel of macro camera, and 2 megapixel of depth sensor. And about the M21, it have triple camera setup, 48 megapixel of wide camera, 8 megapixel of ultra wide camera, and 2 megapixel of depth sensor. So the winner here is 9 Power because it have 2 megapixel of macro camera sensor. And about the selfie camera of the devices, 9 Power have 8 megapixel of wide camera, M21 have 20 megapixel of wide camera. So the winner here is M21 because it can produce high resolution of photos. Let's talk about the camera features of the devices. Both of the devices have LED flash with HDR and panorama, so it's a tie here. And about the video recording options in the devices. 9 Power can shoot full HD video max at 30 fps, but M21 can shoot 4K video max at 30 fps. Full HD video max at 30 fps with gyro electronic image stabilization. So without a doubt, the winner here is M21 because of 4K video recording it have. Moving to the performance of the devices. Let's start with the operating system of the devices. Both of the devices come with Android 10 support, so it's a tie here. And about the user interface of the devices, 9 Power have MIUI, whereas M21 have one UI. So I will call it a tie here because it's up to you which UI you like it or not, it's up to you. Let's talk about the processor of the devices. 9 Power is powered by Snapdragon 662, whereas M21 is also powered by, whereas M21 is powered by Exynos 9611. So it's a tie here because both of the devices have same processing speed. And about the GPU of the devices, 9 Power comes with Adreno 610 GPU, whereas M21 comes with Mali G72. So the winner here is M21 because it can give you more FPS in games. Let's talk about the clock speed of the devices. 9 Power can clock at 2.0 GHz based on Octa Core Cryo chipset, whereas M21 can clock at 2.3 GHz based on octa-core cortex chipset so the winner here is m21 because it have high clock speed and about the ram variants in the devices redmi 9 power have 4 gigabyte of ram option in the other hand m21 have 4 and 6 gigabyte of ram option so the winner here is m21 because it have multi ram options let's talk about the internal storage of the devices 9 power have two storage options 64 and 128 gigabyte in the other hand m21 have 64 and 128 gigabyte of options so it's a tie here because both of the devices have same data read and write speed and about the external storage of the devices both of the devices have dedicated micro sdxe card slot option so it's a tie here moving to the display of the devices let's talk about the screen size of the devices 9 power have 6.53 inches of display in the other hand m21 have 6.4 inches of display so the winner here is 9 power because of bigger display size it have and about the screen to body ratio 9 power have 83.4 percent whereas m21 have 84.2 percent so it's a tie here because both of the devices have approached the same ratio let's talk about the screen resolution of the devices 9 power have full hd plus display whereas m21 also have full hd plus display so it's a tie here and about the display type of the devices, 9 Power have IPS LCD display, whereas M21 have Super AMOLED display. So the winner here is M21 because Super AMOLED can produce much more vibrant colors. Moving to the body features of the devices, let's talk about the thickness of the devices. Redmi 9 Power have 9.6 mm of thickness, whereas M21 have 8.9 mm of thickness. So the winner here is M21 because it have slimmer body design. Talking about the weight of the devices, Redmi 9 Power have 98 grams of weight, whereas M21 have only 88 grams of weight. So the winner here is M21 because of lighter body weight it have. And about the protective glass of the devices, both of the devices have Gorilla Glass 3, so it's a tie here. Let's talk about the build quality of the devices. 9 Power have plastic bag with plastic frame, and M21 also have plastic bag with plastic frame, so it's a tie here. And about the SIM options in the devices, both of the devices have dual nano SIM support, so it's a tie here. Moving to the some of the most important features of the devices, starting with the fingerprint scanner of the devices. 
Nine Power have side mounted fingerprint scanner, whereas M21 have rear mounted fingerprint scanner. It's up to you which side of fingerprint scanner you prefer, it's up to you. And about the sensors in the devices, both of the devices have accelerometer, proximity and compass, but M21 have gyro, so the winner here is M21. Let's talk about the battery capacity of the devices. 9 power have 6000 mAh of battery, whereas M21 also have 6000 mAh of battery. So I will call it a tie here. And about the charging speed of the devices, 9 power have 18 watts of fast charging, whereas M21 have 15 watts of fast charging. So the winner here is 9 power because 18 watts of fast charging can charge up your device faster. Let's talk about the loudspeaker of the devices. Redmi 9 power have stereo speakers, whereas M21 have normal speakers. So the winner here is 9 power because it can produce much more immersive sound. And about the headphone jack of the devices, both of the devices comes with 3.5 mm of headphone jack. So again, it's a tie here. Moving to the communication chips in the devices. Starting with the WLAN of the devices. Both of the devices have Wi-Fi AC, dual band Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi direct and hotspot. So it's a tie here. And about the Bluetooth version of the devices, 9 power have 5th gen of Bluetooth, whereas M21 also have 5th generation of Bluetooth. So it's a tie here. Let's talk about the GPS chips and the devices. Both of the devices have AGPS, GLONASS and BDS. But M21 have Galileo chip. So the winner here is M21. And about the USB connectivity of the devices. 9 power have 2nd gen of Type-C connector with ODG support. But M21 have 2nd gen of Type-C connector. So the winner here is 9 power because it have OTG support. Moving to the price of the devices. In the international market, 9 power is available from 150 US dollars and M21 is available from 250 US dollars. In the Indian market, 9 power will start from 11,000 rupees and M21 is also available from 14,000 rupees. So the conclusion of the video is in the camera, the winner is 9 power. In the performance, the winner is M21. In the display, the winner is M21. In the body segment, the winner is M21. In the features of the devices, it's a tie here. In the communication chips, the winner is 9 power. And about the prices, it's a tie here. So the decision is totally used which device you like the most so far and let me know in the comment below what do you think which device is better for you. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you like our content, please like our video, share this video and subscribe to our channel. Comment what's your thought in the comment below. If you're watching this video on Facebook, please like our page tag dad. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, here's my Instagram ID on the screen. This is Amit and I will see you guys in the next one. Till then, bye.